Do you know who I am? Answer me. No. You killed my boyfriend. It was an accident. Huh? An accident? You don't accidentally kill Spider-Man. That boy was Spider-Man. Yeah, that's right. Now you better start talking before I send you to hell to meet him. Do it. What? Pull the trigger. Avenge your mate. You won't get another chance. MJ! Don't! No. Peter, he wouldn't want that. Then he was foolish. As are you. Who? You're late. Pick up the pace. Who knows what kind of trouble the Spider-Man got up to while we were out investigating that message. Looks like that kind of trouble. Okay, Buckethead and friend. Stay right there if you want to remain alive. I'll offer you the same bargain, friend. I have no reason to harm you. Yet. But attack us, and everything changes. Now that is some choice bounty hunter talk. Forgot how much I missed it. We don't negotiate with intruders. Then there's nothing more to say. Finnick. <laughs> You have less rock power than Spider-Man. Still, there's strength behind your blows. What does he mean by that? No time to think about it. Focus on winning. Oh, great. So long for now. He's, he's getting away! We have to get back to Sanctuary. Make sure everyone's okay. I don't like what he said about Spider-Man. I can't believe they're gone. Spider-Man, good to see you're okay. What were Fed and his sidekick doing here? I'm not okay. What do you mean? Spider-Man 2? MJ? They're gone. No. I came out here to calm down, but it just made me think of Ronan. I feel so empty. I can barely stand. You want my advice? Return to duty. What? I'm just saying. Focus on what's familiar. For you, that's knocking IO skulls together. What's the point? Of destroying the imagined order? That's easy. No, of anything. I've made so many allies in the last few months, and now they're all gone. What's the point of making all these friends if I'm just going to lose them? What's the point of continuing at all? I'm not going to pretend to have the answer, Spider-Man. But I can tell you I've had my share of low points. Times I thought I couldn't keep going, especially in my early years. Somehow, I always seemed to pull together. Yeah, but how? I'm not the best at this touchy-feely stuff. All I can do is share some stories and hope they help. I'll take anything you got. Okay, well, let's see. Where to begin? Filmora is a powerful and easy to use video editing software that makes it easy to bring your creativity to life. Filmora is a great choice for both beginner and experienced editors with a wide selection of presets, effects, filters, and tools that will make your videos shine. Level up your editing with intuitive object tracking that's accessible to everyone. Add special audio effects to video clips like, like echo, echo, reverb, and phone effects. Influencers from around the world used all the new features of Filmora to create a video together. Check it out in the link in our description. Start creating your own videos with Filmora, and let us know what you make by using the hashtag CreateWithFilmora. Now back to the video. Uh, running all night. So hot. Tired. Where am I? Water! Stop, deserter! No, you stop. Wait! Ah! Gotta keep moving. Ah! You, you're the foundation. What do you want? Please, I'm, I'm not with Io anymore. I'm independent, okay? Please don't hurt me. I can't be 
this guy. Gotta get out of here. Did I lose him? No, no, no! Calm down. Calm down. Time for a Hail Mary. What? Sloan, I need- Oh, that's rich. You need something from me? Backup. I need backup. Please, the Foundation's after me. And I can't fight him. I'm exhausted. Running away from home is exhausting, isn't it? Such a waste of energy. I'm sorry, I swear. I think the symbiote took over. I don't know what happened. I want to come back. I want you to protect me. The symbiote is a perfect organism. It seeks strength and amplifies it. I guarantee the weakness you showed last night, the cowardice, that was all you. I know. I know I'm a coward. I want to be brave. I want to be useful to you. But to do that, I think I have to survive. Please! You're not worth an airstrike. For now, Foundation is your problem. But... Part of apologizing is working to undo your mistake. Make those outlaws pay for what they've done. Infiltrate their base at Chonker Speedway. Terminate Spider-Man and that pink woman, Harlow. And I'm back in? And I'll consider it. Yes! I won't let you down, boss. You already have. Okay, I got this. Just gotta keep running. Look who's back. How goes the solo revenge quest? Find anyone we can interrogate? Thumbs up, thumbs down. See, I'm great at reading faces, but you're not giving me much to go on there either. Forget it. Just finished taking inventory. Armories are basically empty. Those gangsters robbed us blind. But they won't be able to use anything they stole, right? It's DNA locked. Unless they... Lop off one of our hands. Is anybody missing a hand? All the same, without our armory, we're defenseless. What if IO comes knocking? Perimeter alert. Trespassers detected. Perimeter There's some good alert. news. The new alarm works. Detected. Hmm. I'll go check it out. Ah, uh, uh, uh. that's close enough. Sloan. In the flesh. Two soldiers won't be enough to take this base. I'm still too weak to fight you, visitor. I came in person as a gesture of trust and good faith. Why would we want either from the Order? Because to reclaim that was stolen from us. I believe we need to work together. Harlow's gang hit you too? Mm-hmm. She's cooperating with two rogue Spider-Men. I think you're acquainted with one of them. Yes, Red Suit. Paid us a visit a few days ago. Nice kid, but naive. Unpredictable. Well, now that he's with Harlow, his actions have become very predictable. She'll pollute, twist, and control him until he's another one of her homicidal puppets. Her other Spider-Man, the evil one, was a product of mine. He's irredeemable and very powerful. The three of them together is a nightmare. We're not helping the Order do anything. End of story. What if Harlow's barbarians take the island before we can rearm? They get bored, start digging, find the zero point? We need to nip Harlow in the bud before she grows out of control. What do you propose? Harlow's betting on two things. Us being too weak to attack Solo, and us being too bitter to join forces. So, we mount a joint assault when she least expects it. Pull the resources we have left. Hit her fast. Hit her hard. If we get Spider-Man 2, even better. <clears throat> if your game meet us at Chonker Speedway outskirts at 2100, we may not get another chance. We'll consider it. Good enough for me. Let's go. But ma'am, isn't Evil Spider-Man on a mission for us? Evil Spider-Man has a lot to prove if he wants to be my project again. If he escapes our assault and lives, maybe he's worth my time. If he dies, oh well. No loose ends. So this is where they're keeping our stuff? I'm gonna be cleaning sand out of our guns for weeks! Or, visitor, you're gonna be cleaning sand. Keep it down. We might not be out of earshot. Oh please, these Neanderthals are too busy playing Hot Wheels to notice us. Couple of sniper shots, courtesy of Big F. 
And the place is ours. Not yet. We wait for nightfall and for reinforcements. It's not even 2100 yet. 20 what? Please just say 9 p.m. We're not in the military. They're not in the military. What are we, cosplaying? Just keep quiet. Hey, look! It's a reinforcement. Singular. This guard is just here to be my eyes and ears. Trust me, my intel is worth a thousand troops. Sure. These thugs race each other just about every hour. If we strike while their eyes are on the track. Chaos. Confusion. Exactly. Arm up and wait for the sound of engines. Copy that. This is going to be interesting. Okay, this one's for all the marbles. Harlow versus the Spider-Men. No way we're going to win in this rust bucket. Chill out. Ben had a truck like this. Let's do him proud. On your marks, get set, go! What happened? Let's get out of here! No, we can't. What are you doing? Get in the back. We'll save you. I don't need your help. Do it, please. I have to fight. I'm not weak. I know. Do you want to be dead? Let's go over the plan one more time. Plan is generous. We're running in, weapons out. Rescuing my crew from the Seven. And praying we don't die? That's pretty much it. Just make sure to cover for each other's weaknesses. We do this as a team, or not at all. Wait, we have weaknesses? Sure, you've got a big mallet, but you're slow. We want you in hand-to-hand -hand scuffles. Meanwhile, I got the web slingers, so I can get some height on them. But if they catch me, I'm toast. As for Harlow, I don't have any weaknesses. Well... Nope, not if I debate. No weaknesses. What about... Shut up! Out here, weaknesses, no matter how small, get you killed. I'm still alive, so what does that tell you? You had friends to rely on? No, that I was stronger than everything that tried to kill me. No weaknesses. Whatever you say. We're coming up on a speedway now. The seven should be just up ahead. Let's do this. Hey, taste my bat! Wait a minute! Where is everybody? It's completely empty. They must have gunned him down and buried him. Or maybe they escaped and ran off into the wilderness. We should look for tracks. Nuh uh. No self respecting outlaw of mine would ever run from a fight. They stood their ground here and died. So it's over? It's not over. Ah! It's the foundation! Don't be scared. We got him outnumbered. Eh, 3v1's too easy. <laughs> Why don't you two sit back and let a pro take her revenge? There's no need for any of that. I'm not here to fight. I want to help you. Huh? What? Oh, uh, yeah? I don't buy that for a second. I know where your friends are. Oh, yeah? We'll spill it. Rogue loopers like your crew are too dangerous to let free. So we imprison them at Sanctuary. But now... The scientist is planning a series of invasive experiments. I no longer believe holding them captive is the right thing to do. Okay, so release them. Easy as that. <sighs> the scientist and visitor don't agree with me, and I can't act alone. I need your help. We're listening. No, we aren't. This guy's clearly trying to pull one over us. 
I just need you to help me infiltrate the sanctuary. I'll get past security. You break out your friends. Oh, and then when we're deep in your weirdo base, you lock us up? Can't you see? Guys, Sanctuary's bad news! He's trying to trick us into turning ourselves in! Sanctuary's where MJ is. And don't you want to rescue your friends no matter what? Yeah, if the what is being dissected alive by alien spacemen, no thank you. I know I don't have the best track record, but I want to do right by you. I'll make sure our journey is safe. I trust him. Excellent. It'll be dark soon. Let's make camp in one of these abandoned houses. We'll sit out at first light. <sighs> Fine, but I got my eye on you. One step out of line, and I'll make sure it's your last. Good night, guys. Good night. Uh, sure. Ah, moonlight. Nice, cool breeze. And no snoring weirdos to spoil it. <sighs> I'm already winded. All this teamwork and hand-holding is making me weak. And this sanctuary mission is a total shot in the dark. Ugh, maybe I should run away now. Start a new gang from nothing. No, Harlow, please don't do that. Gumbo, how'd you get in my head? Don't ask me! Guess <sighs> that car wreck missed me up worse than I thought. You have come to rescue us? Why? You get caught, you deserve to rot, I always say. You were willing to try. I was. But the Foundation? Sanctuary? This whole thing is way too risky. I mean, no hard feelings, but you ain't worth the trouble anymore. <laughs> Time you showed your true colors, and to think Spider-Man trusted you! That was his mistake. Yeah, and did you kill him and his friend? No one's coming to help you. Oh, perfect. What's happening? Harlow's in trouble. <sighs> Stay back! The Foundation! We shouldn't have trusted him! <laughs> She's a loser, right? I'm telling you, I can do this on my own! That's it. Push them away. Make this easier for me. Enough! Hang on, Harlow! We're, We're coming! Yeah! Take that! I hope you're happy. You ruined everything! I'm happy. Ruined what? What are you planning? You'll never see MJ again. Come back! Hey, what was that? Dust yourself off. We gotta get to Sanctuary before Foundation tells them we're coming. Hey, I asked you a question. You wanna know why we saved you? I said, I got this one. We can't be a team if you keep underestimating me. So what? We just let you attack everything by yourself? Doesn't sound like teamwork to me. <sighs> well, then maybe you don't belong on my team. You almost died. Yeah, you're right. I've only worked with you a few days and I'm already weaker. You got in a car crash. You're still healing. Pfft, I'm an alien, guy. I could be immune to car crashes for all you know. I don't think you're immune to car crashes. Well, whatever. If my crew was weak enough to get locked up, then that's what they deserve. Go get me a new crew. What about Mary Jane? What about her? Good luck busting her out. Hope you don't die. If Harlow won't save her crew, we'll have to do it ourselves. Come on. Uh, Spider-Man? Yeah, don't tell me you got cold feet. It's a little late for that. Well, it's just without Harlow. Do we really stand a chance against these guys? If we fight him head on, no way. But we're Spider-Men. We gotta approach this a little differently. Look, I bet he's got some kind of key card we can use. We beat him up, take it, the facility is ours. Are you sure? He's unarmed. That sounds like something Sloan would tell me to do. Well, I'm not Sloan. We're doing this for the right reasons. 
We gotta save MJ and Harlow's people. Right reasons. Right. Okay. That's the spirit. Follow my lead. And attack on signal. Got it? Got it. Who's there? Yeah! Ah. What? Ah. You won't. Beat me. I can squash a Spider-Man. How about two? We got him now! Good thing I got here in time. What should we do with these two? Wait, Foundation! I thought, thought you were against him experimenting on us. I only said that to gain your trust and lure you here. No cost is too great to protect the Zero Point. What's the Zero Point? That's need to know. Visitor, help me haul him to the vaults. Scientists can decide what to do with him tomorrow. No, wait, I... Uh. Oh. You're in a lot of trouble, Spider-Man. We know you're working with the Seven. Who, who are you? Where am I? I'm tired of talking to that mask. No, please! My identity is all I have! No! Wait, something's wrong. Spider-Man doesn't look like that. What are you talking about? I'm Spider-Man. Spider-Man looks like me. We got the wrong one! Oh, okay. Yeah, my bad. I'm the wrong Spider-Man, which means you should probably let me go and get on with your day. Have a good one. Not so fast. You owe us for wasting our time. What do you mean? The Spider-Man we want is still out there. You're going to capture him for us. <laughs> then he ends up here? You interrogate and torture him? <laughs> no way. There are cameras trained on this room. By now, we have your true identity from every angle. What? Bring Spider-Man here alive, or we'll beam it straight through the zero point, and every world and every reality will know exactly who you are. No, I... no! Peter Parker will cease to exist. There will only be Spider-Man. Okay, I'll... I'll do what you want. Where is he? Your spider senses will lead you to each other. Bring him here in 24 hours, or we'll release your identity. Okay, I'm going, I'm going! <sighs> well, we tried our best. <sighs> yep, guess that's worth something. Look! Mr. Foundation, I know I'm the one you want. Okay, that's assuming a lot. So if you've got to satisfy your bloodlust, take me out and let MJ go. I'm not going to do that. Please, you can't kill both of us. Huh, I'm not going to kill either of you. What? But we broke into your base, liberated your prisoners, fought you guys, and- uh, Let's not change his mind. No, my mind is made up. You're each too valuable to kill, and too costly to contain. So that leaves one option. Let us go? Not quite. Io was building a powerful network of operatives on the island. We need new blood if we're going to stop them. We want you to join the Seven. What? <gasps> He's nearby. I can sense him. Just gotta drop in and knock him out. Easy peasy. So, what do you say? We need your answer as soon as possible. Well, if we joined, it wouldn't be the seven anymore. It'd be the nine, so... Only founding members are included in the count. You'd be... operatives. Cannon fodder. This island is a dangerous place. No matter where you go, you'll be fighting for your life. At least here, you'll have a roof over your head. Hmm, guess it beats starving to death. We're in. Great. So before our first mission, can we rest for a few hours? No time. 
Our equipment picked up some anomalous energy readings this morning. Could be nothing, or maybe Io is tampering with the space-time continuum again. Scope out the perimeter, find me some terrain samples. My spider sense isn't supposed to work here, but it's going crazy all of a sudden. Must be something huge to break through the interface. Hey, I'm not done briefing you. Where are you going? Come back! Greetings, Spider-Man and Associates. Yikes! Her again? I'm sure you think you've won today. Think? We definitely won! That tornado was pitiful! I think you'll find cooperating with the Seven is more dangerous than you realize. Uh, what does she mean? Just more IO mind games. I'm not here to judge you for your choice of friends, only to show you the consequences of your meddling. Ronin! Don't worry, he's alive. For now. You get to decide how long he stays that way. Let him go! Ugh, it's simple. Leave the Seven and I'll release him to you. Continue to get in my way and, well, I'll spare you the gory details. You have 24 hours to make your decision. Sloan out. Ronan, we have to save him. Easy, pal. That's exactly what Sloan wants you to say. She's expecting us to try something stupid. Then what do we do? I can't just leave him there. Plan later. Right now, we've got bigger fish to fry. What do you mean? What's that noise? Killer robots. Killer robots? We call them Cobalt. A sect of bionic loopers who've networked their intelligence. Very dangerous. What do they want with us? Nothing good. MJ, come with me. Let's see if we can hack them through the Daily Bugle Wi-Fi. Copy that. Wait, uh, maybe you should stay here with us. Why? Because, uh... You aren't jealous, are you? D no Okay, the killer robots are almost here. Let's have an adult conversation about this later. MJ, wait! Let's go, scientist. Do not resist. Well, they're clearly masters of rhetoric. I think they're gonna let their fists do the arguing. These guys are tough. Yeah. There aren't any soft parts to punch. We need something sharp. You got a sword? I would if I stayed with Ronin. Oh, well. <laughs> First it is, then. <laughs> ah, take that, you oversized action figure. Let's just hope there aren't any more. Do, not resist. Do we run? I don't think I've Do got a second round in me. Run? Where? Do not resist. Could you at least say something else? What, uh, do you think they're gonna do to us? Well, they aren't called hurt or robots, are they? Oh, no. No! <laughs> that must be MJ. She did it! Don't sound so surprised. Uh, I'm not. Just for a second there, it really seemed like we were gonna die. MJ was handling it. She's a natural. Aw, thanks, scientist. Not a compliment. Just stating fact. Now let's get back to base before any more goons show up. Copy that. On my way. Okay, so, saving Ronin? Who's got ideas? Here's one. Ronin means masterless samurai. I'm assuming this guy can take care of himself? Sure, but... So it's settled. We let him break himself out, thereby not giving Io exactly what they want. I don't care if this is a trap. I owe Ronin a lot. Helping him out is the least I can do. Come on, guys. If Paradigm's message means anything, it's that IO are gearing up for something big. They take you off the board, that's one less person standing in the way of whatever's coming. So that's how it's gonna be, huh? Every man for himself. No, try and keep up. I just said we need you. Yeah, as long as I'm useful. I'm going to rescue Ronan. Anyone who wants to come, meet me by the big statue. Hey, going there alone is suicide! Spider-Man! What's all the yelling? <sighs> Io has Spider-Man's samurai friend, so in typical Spidey fashion, he's risking everything to bail him out. This could be our chance to infiltrate the Order's computer systems. Find out why Paradigm was so worried. He won't get that far. It's obviously a trap. They're expecting him. Sure. But they won't expect us. I propose a two-pronged assault. You and I break into their servers while the Spider-Men spring Ronin. Yeah, as much as I'd love to join your suicide mission, you should take MJ. 
She can hack circles around me. Wait! Plus, I've been inside the I.O. computers before. Very well. MJ, you're with me on this one. No, wait! MJ, uh, this mission sounds really dangerous. Let's just have a scientist to do it. Okay, so when we're fighting a tornado, it's fine. But the second I might be in the room with another guy... What? You think that's what this is about? I just want you to be honest with me. If you're jealous, tell me. This doesn't work unless we communicate. I'm not jealous. Uh-huh. Fine. I'll prove it. I'll let you go on the mission. It's not about you letting me do anything. You don't control me, Peter. You're not my boss. I just don't want you to get hurt. I'm already hurt. You two catch up with the other Spider-Man. I've got a few questions for Mr. Foundation here. You got it. Uh, come on, MJ. I'm going. Okay. What's the issue? What's really going on here? Elaborate. If all you want is access to IO's computer systems, wait for the heat to die down, then strike. Does it make sense to go now? Unless... Careful. You plan on using the Spider-Man as a distraction. Can you blame me? You heard Paradigm. Something terrible is coming. We need to find out what, no matter the cost. Look, I'm all for sacrificing loopers in the name of science, but the Spider-Men are seven operatives now. You inducted them yourself. We've never gone against our own before. Plus... They have potential, I know. You have to think about them as an investment. Sure, but right now, they're reckless and hot-headed. It's only a matter of time before they blow a mission and Io puts them away for good. I know investing in them was my idea, but I think it's time to cash out. This is a slippery slope. I can't support this. Calm down. I'll give them everything they need to succeed. At least this way, if they don't, we get some Io secrets as part of the deal. <sighs> I guess. Fine. MJ, wait. You want to talk about what happened in there? What happened? Well, I just want to make sure you understand I'm not jealous. Sure. If you got feelings for the Foundation, honestly, that's fine. Why would you assume that's not how it is at all? Really? You don't believe me at all, do you? Well, I... Do we just not trust each other? Is that our problem? No, MJ! I trust you. I trust you. I swear. You should go ahead and find the other uh, Spider-Man, Mr. Foundation, sir. MJ and I have some stuff to work out before the mission. Just be ready by nightfall. Yes, sir. No one's coming. I, can I really save Ronan on my own? No, who am I kidding? I'm going to get eaten alive. I don't have to do this, right? If anyone should do the saving, it's Foundation. He's the one with the statue. Hey, Spider-Man. What are you doing here? Just telling you you're not going to be alone. We're coming with you. Oh, great! Um... You seem troubled. What's on your mind? With all due respect, sir, I don't think you'd get it. Try me. Ever since I got here, I felt weak. I don't know. I was born to swing between tall buildings, not run through dark hallways and fields all day. But obviously this isn't stuff a jacked leader with his own statue would understand. Not true. As a leader, I have to confront my fear, my anxiety, constantly. Really? I have to make difficult decisions. Sometimes, the aftermath isn't pretty. But the mark of a leader isn't a lack of fear. It's... Responsibility. Exactly. It's knowing what's expected of you, what's really important, and making the right choice, even if it's hard, even if you're scared. That's what my uncle said. Can I count on you, Spider-Man? You bet. That's great to hear. Come on, I got something to show you. So, what did you want to show me? Take a look for yourself. You found another Spider-Man? Oh, this one looks cool. It's just a suit. It's your suit. This is for me? Of course. We call it the Future Foundation Suit. It's made up of third generation unstable molecules. So, if you don't like the pearl finish, you can swap back to red and blue anytime. And another plus, you never have to wash it. I, I don't know what to say. How can I thank you? Don't die tonight. I won't. This feels awesome! I'm gonna go practice with it right now! Why'd you give it to Spider-Man 1? Seemed like Spider-Man 2 had more spunk. Spider-Man 2's jealousy is dangerous. He's becoming harder to predict. We can't afford any extra variables tonight. 
Okay, let's review the plan. Spider-Man 1 and 2 will strike first and attempt to rescue Ronin. While the guards are busy, MJ and I will introduce Spyware to their assistant. Suss out exactly what they've got planned. Uh, cool suit. Where'd you get that? Uh, uh Foundation gave it to me. No fair! Duh, I'm so jealous. Hey, save that for after the mission, Spider-Man 2. I don't want anyone getting in their heads while we execute the plan. But, it's so cool. I'm aware of that. Will your jealousy distract you? No, no, of course not. Good. Let's depart before it gets any later. You're really wasting breath at this point, and you have precious little left. Don't act like you care if I live or not. On the contrary, you're crucial to my plan. You dying would kill me. Then why the torture? I'm not torturing you, Ronan. This is Spider-Man's doing. All he has to do to make this stop is lead the Seven. And yet... Ah, my, my master will save me. By harming me, you've sealed your fate. Ooh, the master that got crushed by the Daily Bugle. <laughs> They're past dead, I'm afraid. Sorry, but I think we should rip that band-aid off. Spider-Man will never fall for your trap. Maybe. But if he doesn't, there's still ways you can be useful to me. This is it. Good luck, Spider-Man. Let's do this. I'll be thinking about you, MJ. Be safe, Peter. Now we just gotta find a way into their system. That's our ticket. Look, guards! If we're quiet, we can catch them by surprise. Uh, what do you think MJ and the Foundation are up to? Uh, breaking into IO's system? Why? Do you think they have chemistry? Why are you asking me? How is this important? Just focus on the mission. Okay, okay, the mission. Watch the tripwire. Oh, noted. Thanks for looking out. Okay, we'll need to trick this tower into broadcasting a hostile program into IO's mainframe. Think you can handle it? No sweat. That's what I like to hear. Okay, attack on three. One, two... Wait! Oh, what now? You sure MJ and the Foundation aren't up to anything weird? Like, what if they're kissing? Do you have any idea how irrational you sound? How would the Foundation kiss anything? He's wearing an airtight spacesuit. Well, if anyone could find a way... I'm just gonna check on them. What? No! Just really quick, one quick peek, and I'll come back, and we'll finish the mission. No problem. I need you here. I'll be back, I'll be back. Hey, wait! Who goes there? It's that spider guy. Quick, get him while he's alone and sad. Okay, I've got admin privileges. We can broadcast any signal we want. Excellent work. No hostiles on radar so far. We make a pretty good team. MJ, are you okay? Peter? Wait, don't. Uh, what's that noise? What did I do? You tripped security. I, I'm locked out. I just wanted to make sure you were safe. How many times do I have to tell you? I can take care of myself. Sure, but. You don't trust me enough to leave me on my own? And now you've ruined the mission. Maybe, uh, maybe we can salvage it? They haven't sent guards yet. Maybe they think it's a false alarm. I'm afraid not. Ah! You're mine. Uh, no, something's wrong. I, I can't. I can't go down here. Oh, come on, new suit. Show me what you can do. I, I gotta. I gotta get out of here. How's my favorite prisoner? I thought I told you, mask off when I speak. That's better. Now we can have an adult conversation. Oh, quit the silent act. It's so played out. I'm not telling you anything. Right, sure. You think you can torture information out of me? Plenty have tried. Torture was never part of the equation. What do you mean? 
When we opened your suit, do you really think the tracker is all we took? No. Yes, we have your memories. It's a lot of data, but once we sift through it, we'll know everything. Every weakness, every secret. You'll never destroy the Seven. Sanctuary is a fortress. A fortress is only as strong as its foundation, and I've broken you. That's all for now. Just wanted to deliver the news and see the look on your face. Have fun rotting. <laughs> no, no! Come back here and face me! Come back! It's over. After all that, I was going to win. I was useless. I failed. No. Foundation, listen to yourself. One psychotic lady throws you in a cell and you fold? What's wrong with you? You've been in worse prisons than this. <sighs> yes, that's right. Just remember the zero crisis. How'd you survive that? Breathe in, breathe out. Conjure the memory. Jones, we won't get another chance. You need to seal off the zero point and overload the device. Overload the device? I'll be trapped in the loop! We both have to find our way back. Just... Don't give up. I... Got it. Here... We... Go! crystal-infested energy caverns go. This isn't a bad place to retire. Did you say retire? Visitor? What are you doing here? I am not visitor. The Zero Point has chosen this form for me. For what reason, I cannot imagine. Okay, so you're some kind of multiversal messenger. Here to tell me something. Spit it out. You can't retire yet, Foundation. You told Agent Jones you would return. You gave him your word. Yeah, to get him off my back. Truth is, I've been looking to quit the game for a long time. I've been in this fight for longer than I can remember. Seemed as good a time as any for one final heroic sacrifice. It isn't heroic if you're giving up. Don't call it giving up. Call it a well-deserved retirement. Visitor, the real visitor, can take it from here. I'm afraid it won't be that easy. If you want eternal rest, you'll have to earn it. I've been earning it for years and years. No friends, no family, no life. Just zero point, zero point, zero point. I never complained. I never ran away. Then this final challenge should be no problem. What? You want me to do gladiatorial combat for your own amusement? I'm done fighting. It's time to let down my load. The Zero Point floods this tunnel with gamma radiation every hour. If you rest here, you won't wake up. Fine, I'll do your challenge. Just don't expect me to enjoy it. Who seeks passage into the Zero Sanctum? Zero Sanctum? The center of the Zero Point, where all timelines end and begin. The Eye of the Storm? The perfect place to rest for all eternity. Okay, I want in. You two, step aside if you want to remain alive. Only those who best us in combat are permitted past this door. Well, then let's get this over with. Sanctum then? Not quite. Look, I don't need a heroic gauntlet right now, okay? I've done my duty. Anyone who questions my power is out of line. I don't make the rules. I'm only a conduit. Okay, but 
The next chamber, after I beat it, I get to rest, right? Perhaps. <sighs> Fine. Okay, what's the gimmick here? It's just a big hole. Those who cross the pit alone are doomed to fail. Sure. Great. But how do I cross it? Those who cross the pit alone are doomed to fail. Is that a riddle? Are we doing riddles now? I only have the instructions the Zero Point gives me. Well, where am I supposed to get some friends, huh? I assume as a weird multiverse hologram, you don't count. You're correct. Yeah, so it's impossible. Now, if I had scientists... Oh! I get it. Do you? Yeah, it's not as mysterious as you'd like to think. I just say, scientist, and the platforms appear. Scientist. Why isn't it working? My lips are sealed. Come on, visitor. Okay, easy. I just have to mention the names of my friends. If you're gonna force me through this gauntlet thingy, the least you could do is make up some challenging puzzles. Okay, hmm. Don't give me that look. I can cross this no problem. Just gotta... This should be easy. Just think. Of another friend I know. Or I could just sleep over this, no problem. I wouldn't risk it. Okay. One more friend. One more friend. Shouldn't be that hard. Paradigm? Uh... Don't tell me you're out already. I'm not. I'm just thinking. You don't have all day. Remember what I said about the radiation? Okay, okay. Hmm. Origin? The sisters? They should count for two. Come on! This thing must be broken. The Zero Point is sending me a hint. No hints. I could do this on my own. An important part of friendship is time. Who do you spend time with? Visitor. Scientist. Who else? Uh... The radiation is coming. Agent... Jones? Impossible! We're not friends. Like I said, I don't make the rules. So this is the Zero Sanctum? No offense, but not exactly relaxing. The glowing purple crystal really harshes the vibe. No, I lied. The Zero Sanctum doesn't exist. What? I made that up to get you here. Why? So I could do you another cosmic favor? After a life of favors? Call it what you like. Look, Cornlet or not, I'm getting old. In my prime. I could have made that jump, no problem. But now... You have to rely on your friends? No. Your test of worth is just wrong. I'm not cut out for hero work. Foundation, this gauntlet wasn't supposed to test your worth, but to remind you of it. But I'm not worthy. Not anymore. Our evidence says otherwise, which means this isn't about retirement. This is about you quitting while you're ahead. <sighs> I know failure is scary. Especially after a lifetime of success. But you are worthy. I know you have what it takes. And how would you know that? You're just a conduit for the zero point. Yes, I believe what it believes. Sure. And it believes in you. Okay, fine. Say I was briefly back in business. What would I have to do? When you sealed the zero point, its energy began to crystallize. Into the spire. Yes. If a looper found a way to weaponize that energy... The results would be catastrophic. Correct. Jones already knows all this. All the loopers have to do is contact him. And problem solved. How often do loopers talk to anyone? Good point. That's where you come in. You need to send a message to the outside. But how? I was hoping you would know. Are you kidding? The conduit for the zero point has no idea? All I can tell you is... It picked this form for me for a reason. The visitor. Hmm. Maybe I'm supposed to solve this like he would. Can't brute force it. Need a more creative angle. I have to be scrappy. Am I on the right track here? I can neither confirm nor deny. <sighs> Obviously. No radio signals can escape the walls of this place. But maybe I can encode my voice in a series of electrical pulses. Send him through this crystal. Okay, now I'm sounding like Visitor. Of course, the energy required for even two words is going to be immense. Better choose carefully. 
I've only failed if I give up without a fight. Hmm. I need to send a message. Io's been excavating crystals just like the one I found in the Zero Point. I bet they've already got a few hooked up to their technology. I'll just give their comm network a little juice from my suit and send out my coordinates in binary. Okay, that's a full battery's worth. Let's hope the Seven pick that up. Now. I just got a rest. Ugh, what day is it? How long has it been since I was outside? On the mend, I hope. Ronan, my back's still on fire. I think I have something that will help. After your Hail Mary came through last week, I'm willing to try anything. I'm glad you're keeping an open mind. Right this way. So what's on tap for today? I'm warning you, if it includes any jumping, running, or even brisk walking, I'm out. Don't worry. We won't be doing any fighting. Today, I'm going to show you a technique my master taught me to accelerate healing. Sign me up! I guess this spot is as good as any. Hmm. Now where to begin? It's tempting to think of your body and your mind as separate. Most people think of their body like a black box, a bunch of cogs turning in the background while the mind is awake. Yeah, but I mean, I'm Spider-Man. I've got great control over my body. Otherwise, I would have face planted off a building by now. You control your arms and your legs. What about your pulse, your breath? Uh, can one even do that? One can and one will. The first step is being mindful of all the processes in your body, all the chemicals and proteins that make you, you. That sounds more like science than magic. Science is magic until you figure it out. Okay, so what do I do? This process starts with the breath. So, breathe. Uh, I've been breathing this whole time, dude. Like this. In. And out. Feel where the air goes, and how it fills up every pocket of you. Your spider sense should make this easy. <sighs> okay, breathing. Here goes. <sighs> like that? Are you feeling the source of your pain? Yeah, like I said, my back hurts. Breathe again, and see if you can be more specific. <sighs> Wait. Whoa. I feel exactly where it's coming from. Now, close your eyes. Focus on muting the pain. Bring your brain and body together. It's... it's working. It doesn't hurt as much. And this is only the beginning. Say... You never told me about your master. He must really be something. That's putting it lightly. What was his name? He didn't go by a name. Only a... Title. Most thought that the Burning Wolf was simply a legend. A story for weary soldiers to frighten the fresh recruits. But I promise you that he is as real as the tides, and just as deadly. They say he is unstoppable. Uncontrollable. But I say, I have tamed the tides.
someone got my message. Gotta make my move now. This place is a maze. I need an escape route. Got the map and my way out. What's this? Restricted files. Io already has my secrets. It's their time to share. And it's encrypted. Imagine what scientists could do with these files. I should be able to brute force it. And they're still locked. Come on, Io. I'm ready for you this time. I got you. Thanks for the gun, buddy. Ugh. Why are IO guns always greasy? Hey, guys. Don't let the prisoner escape! Our jailbird tried to fly away. Sloan, I... You've still got that mask on, which means I'll be doing the talking. It's quite annoying that despite being in one of our highest security cells, you managed to escape. It's time to reestimate the benefit of keeping you alive. Oh, I'm sure we can find somewhere to keep you. For now. I'll never take the sun for granted again. And fresh air. <sighs> ah, it's great to be above ground. What is this place? The last thing I remember is being hit on the head. Then, weeks of suffocating darkness. I need to find Ronan. Maybe I could question the locals. Do not resist! Stop shooting! I mean you no harm! Looper detected. Eliminate without mercy. These brainless maniacs can't be reasoned with. All they understand is violence. I shouldn't release my full power. Something's different inside me. I'm, I'm losing control. Ah! Is this what you wanted? Grave threat detected. Scorched Earth protocol authorized. Ah! <sighs> Who was that? It's like my other form had a mind of its own. I need to find Ronan. If he's smart, he'd head for the first town, not infested with evil robots. There! Your master sounds like a pretty cool guy. Sometimes I wish he wasn't. Then, maybe it'd be easier to say goodbye. You're one of the toughest, hardiest guys I've met. Whoever trained you must be even tougher and hardier. He is a force to be reckoned with. See what I mean? Mark my words. You'll be reunited in no time. Last warning, stranger. Back off, nobody gets hurt. You wouldn't be able to hurt me regardless. Really, pal? You think I carry this ridiculous arm blade around for my help? Sounds like there's some trouble brewing. That voice. Let's go check it out. <gasps> Could it really be? Spider-Man, Samurai, just in time. Help us escort this loiterer off the premises, will ya? That's no loiterer. He's my master. Ronan, is that you? It is. I never thought I'd see you again. I'm so glad you're alive. Uh, excuse me? Yeah, sorry. No teary reunion, no matter how sappy or drawn out, is getting this guy through our gate. What do you mean? Your master is a looper from the wilderness. He's armed. Dangerous and has just a terrible vibe in general. Samurai know each other by blade skill alone. Vibe is a tool of lesser men. Wait, wait, there's no need to fight. Ronin's told me all about this guy. He's awesome. Awesome how? Well, in the story, he sliced this dude almost in half, then ran up to this castle in the middle of the woods and chopped a bunch of other dudes. So, and correct me if I'm misinterpreting this, he infiltrated a secure facility and systematically murdered its leadership? Yeah, we should definitely let that guy in. 
No, he's cool, dude. I swear. With Foundation gone, we can't risk inducting any more shifty characters. No. I'm sorry. If he doesn't want any trouble, Ronan's master needs to leave. Now. Then I'm leaving too. No, wait. There's gotta be compromise here. You should know by now that the Seven never compromise. He's right. Now scram. So what then? This is goodbye? Maybe not. What do you mean? The Seven have taught you all they can, but you have only begun your training with the Blade. Oh, sure. Like Spider-Man's gonna leave his cushy job with the Seven to squat in the woods with a couple samurai. Well... No, you can't be considering it. These guys bathe like once a year. Plus, Foundation's still in trouble. We need your help to find him. Don't make the wrong choice. I won't. Come on, Ronan. Hey, so that's it? We give you a fancy new suit and this is how you treat us? You're gonna regret it. <sighs> Don't tell Spider-Man this, but I was actually starting to not hate him a little bit. And I don't not hate anybody! Operatives come and go. We need to focus on the Foundation. Right. I think it's safe to say MJ's remote door hack was a failure. We need to strike before Sloan moves into another location. Good thing I already have a plan. Can I ask you a question? No. I'm actually very busy staring at the floor. I'm kidding. Sheesh, you IO guys are terrible with social cues. Half my co-workers wear masks all the time. You're even worse. You got a full-on helmet. It's a miracle we can understand each other through all these radio filters. Boo-hoo. My boss makes me wear armor. I was supposed to be an analyst, but with the Spider-Men killing our guards left and right, they're plucking people from all departments to fill the suits. I still dream about my desk sometimes. All the knickknacks that will never be. Go ahead. Ask your question. Why did you choose this job? I didn't. But you, you seem strong enough to leave if you wanted to. You mean... If I weren't in a high-security I.O. prison? Right, sure. Look, as long as the Zero Point has existed, greedy credence have been trying to abuse its power. So, me and the Seven hold the line. It's not about wanting to, it's our duty. Well, it's my duty to make sure prisoners don't poop themselves. But you don't see me waxing poetic about it. Hey. You want a job you can be proud of? Sanctuary's got plenty of desks that need filling. You serious? Yeah, our tech department is one person, and I think she's in high school. Well, shucks, when can I start? <laughs> hey, I was talking to him. You want me to apologize for saving you? Let's just get out of here. Perfect timing is what I would say if I weren't waiting here for two hours. It's good to have you back too. We should be safe here for a few days, so long as we avoid IO patrols. Avoid? It was IO who dumped that city on my head, wasn't it? Yep, multiversal hijinks are pretty much their brand. Well, I need to show them mine. Are you okay, Master? I don't think confrontation is the best strategy here. IO act like they own this island, because no one else has shown them otherwise. I say take the fight to them. Great plan, but we don't have a hope of challenging them without the Seven. Let's brainstorm how to get you on their good side. They slandered me, dirtied my name. I would not join forces with them even if my life depended on it. Well, it does, no offense, but two samurai and one Spider-Man don't stand a chance against the Order. We need the Seven's help if we're going to survive. You doubt my power? No, uh, what I mean is... There's no point arguing about this right now. What we need now is food. Yes, a hunt always improves my mood. This will be your chance to prove your mettle, Spider-Man. Here comes some prey now. No way. The pizza guy? We can't eat him. I'm more interested in what he's carrying. Oh, pizza. Right. Hey, whoa! Watch where you're pointing that thing, man! My leg just healed! Surrender your cargo. What? No, man! Somebody paid for this! I gotta deliver it! You dare deny me! Ah! Ow! Not my good leg! No! Are you okay? Don't touch me! I can't believe you're working with that guy! I thought you were better than that, Spider-Man! I am. I am. Uh... What's wrong with your master? Why is he acting like this? I don't know. 
But we shouldn't stay out in the open. Man, it's good to be back home. Forgot how much I missed that giant statue of myself. If we can just table the delusions of grandeur for one second. You're one to talk. It's not delusions if you're correct. I'm objectively great. The seven, back together. What an achievement. Okay, back on topic. You told me Spider-Man's traveling with this burning wolf character now? Yep, MJ's been combing the airwaves all day for information about him. Turns out he's a pretty violent dude. Well, he's trying to survive. Many loopers are forced into violence by their material circumstances. Philosophy 101 aside, the people who oppose Burning Wolf don't seem to live very long. We need to retrieve Spider-Man as soon as possible. Uh, excuse me? I don't stick my neck out for deserters. He's too valuable an asset to lose. Plus, he's wearing my special suit. I'm going after him. You sure? If you need to rest, scientist or I can... No. I've rested enough. It's time to take action. I'll find Spider-Man and drag him back here by whatever means necessary. Good luck. With Burning Wolf on the loose, you'll need it. Nothing like the bounty of the hunt. It's pizza. Pizza that we won through triumph in combat. Ah, victory is sweet. Or more precisely, cheesy. Ugh. Ah. What's wrong? I'm fine. Just a stitch in my side. That voice again. I think there's something wrong with him. I'm fine! I'm fine! I think his time underground damaged him somehow. I can sense dark energy swirling around him. Spider-Man. See if you can find any clombo berries around him. Aren't those for dinosaurs? I can brew them into a healing self. Go quick. Doesn't feel too great finding medicine for that slice-happy wolf guy. But Ronan seems to really respect him. Let's see. Clombo berries, clombo berries. There they are. Nice night for a stroll. Foundation, you escaped. Visitor and scientist came to my rescue. You were suspiciously absent. Ronan needed my help. He still does. His master's in danger. Do you know what this master of his is capable of? Something tells me you've already gotten a taste, and you're still here. You need to consider how much your loyalty is worth, Spider-Man. I owe Ronan my life. If he needs me, I'll be there for him. I was hoping we could do this the easy way. Oh, well. Whoa, whoa! Yeah. Hey, think about what you're doing, Spider-Man. There will be consequences. Here's your berries. I'm going to bed. Thank you, Spider-Man. You deserve a good night's rest. Here you go, Master. Ronan, are you loyal to me? Of course. We've been apart for so long. I don't feel like I completely know you anymore. I could say the same about you. Why did you injure the pizza guy? He was weak. The island is strong now. Only the strong survive. You don't sound like yourself, Master. Do not question me. If you are truly loyal, you'll do what I ask. I understand. I will do whatever you wish, Master. You must kill Spider-Man. What? I could sense him communing with his old allies, plotting to betray us. He knows I am a threat to the Seven, and that I am weak. He is too dangerous to leave alive. Uh, I can't. He's my friend. But I am your master. Very well. Sounds like he's asleep. Shouldn't be too difficult. Spider-Man. Huh? You need to leave. My master wants me to kill you. Huh? His health is worse than I thought. There's a corruption inside him, populating his mind. You should leave before- Ronan! I knew you couldn't do it! I'll have to finish him off myself! Wait! Wait! <laughs> no! It's okay. It's okay. Ronan! You turned my own apprentice against me! How dare you! Ah! Let's move, before he recovers. This may be a sanctuary, but it cannot keep us safe forever. 
Perhaps it's time for plan B. Instead of waiting for Io to attack, we take the fight to them. Too late for that. You again? Come to finish the job? Yes, but first, you have something that Io wants. Drive? Power? Funny. No, something more real. And I think it's hiding within that statue behind you. The statue? My friend, that's nothing but a big stupid boulder. But hey, it gives people hope that someone's watching over them. That someone's got their back. Not for long. I will see to that. So what? You're just Io's lapdog now? Some wolf you are. Shut up! That's a cute new outfit, by the way. Did Sloane knit you that herself? I said, shut up! Not my forte. So, we gonna do this or what? Finally. Are you ready to stop talking? I've been waiting for this. Time to show you what the burning wolf can do! Not bad, but you haven't seen anything yet. Whoa! Okay, that's new. Switching strategies. Your sanctuary will burn until it's melting like ash! I don't think so. Not again! Even with my newfound power, it's not enough! Did Io not warn you about me? I'm not someone you want to face, mano y mano. I will remember that for next time. <laughs> that takes care of him. Now to check on the treasure that Io's after. Jonesy, I'm home. 998, 999, 1000. That's quite the bump, Jones. Oh, foundation. Did you see? I'm ripped. This barbell feels lighter than air. Impressed? Someone must have forgot to turn the assisted gravity off. Let me fix that for you. No, no, I'm good. Let me have this win, okay? <laughs> Fine, how you holding up? A bit bored, very hungry. Please tell me you brought some pizza pit. Well... Uh, come on, man. If you're gonna keep me locked up beneath this statue, it's the least you could do. The least I could do is hand you back over to Slow. <laughs> well, when you put it that way, I've been holed up in worse spots before. It's quite nice in here. You look great, by the way. Relax, Jones. You're safe here. But it looks like my hunch was right. Sloan hasn't forgotten about you. Or forgiven us for the stone we pulled on the other side. Yeah, we really humiliated her last time around, didn't we? Guessing she's holding a bit of a grudge? To say the least. She sent assassin after assassin here to try and take me down. Feels like she's doing it just to annoy me at this point. So, what's the plan? I was just wondering that myself. You know, Jones, there's more to this place than meets the eye. What place? The island? <laughs> I could have told you that. No. Specifically, sanctuary. A secret we're keeping guarded until the time is right. I thought I was your big secret. Sloane knows about you. So, not much of a secret anymore. No, there's something much bigger being put into motion. Can't wait to see it. Give me a heads up before it all goes down, will ya? This is that heads up. I need you to vacate. But you just said this place was safe. I just don't want you to get crushed. Okay, that sounds ominous. But where will I go? Maybe you should try keeping up with the Joneses. Those guys? But, but... They're all so weird. You realize that you're talking about yourself, right? Despite my zero point shenanigans, I still like to think of myself as an individual. Well, you'll have plenty of time to discuss that with the other yous. Their jungle hideaway will be much safer for you now. Fine, fine. I can tell when I'm not wanted. Ah, <sighs> no, but really, thanks for everything, big guy. Huh? You saved me from getting my brain turned into slurp by Dr. Sloan. I just... I appreciate everything you're doing for us. If only the rest of your kind saw things as you do. They'll come around. Trust me. Ha! Ha! Training? You can never be too prepared. Mind if I join you? If you must. Ha! Ha! Not bad. But I still got a trick or two up my sleeve. Then show me. Oh. Uh. Ha. Ha. There. Oh. 
Not bad. I've still got it. Well, thanks for stopping by. Hold on. I didn't come here just to rumble. I wanted to see how you're doing. What do you mean? I know you and Breakpoint were close. I'm sorry we had to send her away. Yeah. She'll be better off back where she belongs. If you say so. In the meantime, maybe we could pair you up with the new AI. I know you work better with a partner. A replacement? I'll pass. Just give it some thought. Some people can't be replaced. You should know that. You were gone for so long that maybe you don't remember. So I'll let that slide, but don't bring a paradigm with me, visitor. You're right. I was gone. I was here. And you were nowhere to be found. And in that time, I forgot our past. Who I was. What we were. Even after you all showed up again, it didn't feel real. But losing Breakpoint, it's reminded me. And? Nothing's changed. The mission comes first. Good. Glad to hear you're still on board. I'll send in a request for a new AI for your suit. But? No buts. You're gonna need the help for what's to come. Well, that's my story. Wow. You have had some low points. But whenever you were feeling despair, you found comfort in others who were going through the same thing. I guess so. The seven stick together for a reason. When something affects one of us, it affects the others. We share every burden, no matter the weight. You're saying I just need to find someone who's gone through what I have. It's a start, and I don't think you'll have to look very far. There's Haven. She and Spider-Man 2 are pretty close, huh? Seems that way. I gotta handle something with scientists. Why don't you go talk to her? See if you can cheer each other up. I'll do that. Best of luck, Spider-Man. Hey, Haven. You okay? <laughs> no. Me neither, but... At least, that makes two of us. Yeah, 